second campaign with the Calgary Flames. Our referees tonight, Kelly Sutherland and Corey Savret. The lines for their Jonathan Deschamps and John Murray. First to two matchups between these two teams. Got to go all the way back to December 5th of 2019 for the last time they met. Forced up top. Flames do not give you a lot of time and space when you have the puck. And that should be no surprise when you know the coach back of the bench. There's one that goes right through the blue crease paint area. The Flames do enough to get it out. Backlund, Coleman, and Manjapani. They're shot by Backlund and the rebound. Covered up by Tukarski and then the loose puck picked up behind the net. Tage Thompson facing the glass, plays it down into the corner. So Sabres working it in tight quarters in the Calgary end. Lucic gives it away. Thompson can't turn, drops to Skinner with a shot. And that one off the end boards, comes back out to the air wall. And below the goal line, it's played around. And Tyler Pitlick slides up to the second line tonight. There's a shot from the high slot. Ube with the shot and the save again by Tukarski. Coolin's a cucumber for as much as he battles back there for the Sabres. Here's a turnover though. Flames with a shot stopped by Tukarski again as Pitlick had himself a free look. So far, Graham, pretty simple, basic game out here the Sabres are. Skinner out there along with Tage Thompson and Rasmus Asplund. As he had himself an open lane, Lucic back the other way, left circle, takes the shot, save, rebound, save again, and Tukarski watches that puck come to the line and out to center ice. And back the other way into the Buffalo zone down the left side. Goudreau trying to get that one into the slot. A couple of white jerseys there, but that's blocked. Now behind the net, right in front. And a save again by Tukarski. The puck is loose off the shot by Matthew Kachuk. And here's another one. Kachuk in front of the net, point blank. You got three guys close there. You've got to realize. He covers there by Pezik. Lucic down in behind the net with it. Short side attempt and Tukarski gets a piece and is cleared down the ice. That was a sneaky play by the Flames. He can't keep it deep. Sabres bring four back to the Calgary line as they enter. Thrown in behind the net. Cousins can't get to it. And the Flames now. Here's a partial break. Shot scores! Johnny Goodrow! He snuck in behind just enough and then roofed it. Yeah, well, Goodrow's going to get his fifth here, Dan. He's covered. He's right on top. But watch this. He uses his body. Look at how he holds that stick way out in front. Miller not able to get a piece of it. And then when he pulls it back in to make the move on the goaltender, Tukarski kind of freezes, gets him down, and he puts that puck straight up and over the glove right underneath the bar. They give him the one goal to eat here. Flames broadcast crew calling the game of Philadelphia. On Tuesday said that might be his best game so far of the season. He had 40 friends and family in the crowd because he grew up in a Philly suburb. So he's carried over that tonight. Sabres looking to counter. Maybe they can. Here's shot to Pat. Save made by Markstrom. Good push. Exploded. And here's Zemgis Gerritsen's early. Sends it along the line. Darlene drops it after making the one move. Broken stick shot. That one at the side of the net. Markstrom's going to cover up. Nice play here by Darlene. Drops it back to Pizzik across to Thompson, and it's a one time Marini at traffic in front. Razor, the Flames took notice that as the period went on, the Sabres, who have been known for hanging around, started pushing back a little no, bit. No, you're right. And everybody knows that now. They know that the Sabres are never out of a game and they're going to keep coming at you. So I would have expect he did prepare his team for this. He starts the Flames away with a pass up to center ice. Manjapani brings it all the way around to the point. Now far side shot. Here's a chance. Tanev is saving the shot. The pass and they score. Manjapani goes to the net. And it's a 2-0 Flames lead. They get an early one here in the second. Here's Calgary. Just quick D to D there. This puck's going to be thrown to the net. Here's the quick shot. You've got one man tied up in front. you got Hag tying up his man in front. Butcher's got nobody. He's just kind of standing there watching to see what's going on, not looking for anybody for Manjapani able to come right. And he's picked up by Lindholm from behind the net with four seconds to go on the man advantage. He sprints to center ice, plays an audible and goes to the net. Here comes the pass across, scores! Matt Kachuk on the right side was the man, as you like to say, that nobody kept their eyes on in that specific moment, and he found the hole. Calgary comes up the ice. They attack with speed. Sabres back off. Look where everybody is. 
Hag's already the top of the circles when they gain the zone. And a quick D to D. You got four guys. Yeah, they're all back, but everybody's backed in towards the net. The middle of the ice is gone, but they leave the perimeter wide open, and that's where Tatuk's able to step in close enough to the middle, just touching it, and the quick shot for the third goal on their 19th shot. Skinner finds a lane, and now it'll be brought up by This is Darlene. He plays it on the wing for Asplund. Darlene stays down low. That puck's going to come all the way back towards Thompson. Couldn't quite figure out where it was. Now a two-on-one back the other way. Mangiapane sends a pass across, and an open net for Mangiapane to finish it off. And the snowball's getting a bit bigger here with 5-0-1 to go in the second. To get it to Mangiapane, but right here, Thompson makes a mistake at the far end. He's got to get a piece of that. He's got to keep it in. And look at that pass play right there. Backman just reaches around here. 11 slides it across to Mangiapane, and he taps it into the empty net. That young man's not missing that one. And Takarski had overplayed right there on the far side. Goudreau on the left side. Send it across. Kachuk. Sends it to the goal line. Tap in far post. I mean, Dustin Tokarski, as I say, he's done a lot, but he's not going to stop this kind of passing with guys wide open at no, the post no, like that. You, no, you're not blaming the goaltender here, and I'm almost just looking down on the bench here. Changing goaltenders here. Here's a quick pass right across. Johnny Goudreau from Monaghan to Chuck. Look at that pass. Straight through. He just kind of sneaks in behind. Nobody even really knows he's there. Nobody's Just enough of a slight hesitation by Bryson there. And the Flames are able to bring it out once again. A minute to go here in the second period. Mangiapane looking for another one. Slaps that one on to Carson. They hung him out to dry there in that second period. And this is just a, a, a mercy change by the coach. Realizing they don't want to leave the guy who's done so much for us to this point in any longer. Flames will bring it back with some speed of their own. Pitlick sends it to the far side. Off the oh! post there and whipped on net by Rasmus Anderson. Looking up at the board, here's a quick cross ice pass. He steps in, takes the quick shot right there. Kajulian not able to get over to him in time. Quick shot beats the glove of Dell. And right off the pop. The Flames chip it out towards center ice. Blake Coleman got a piece of it. Here's an open man right in front. Majapani looking for the hat trick, and that one is stopped by Dell. This is Majapani again. This is Zadorov, and back to Majapani again. Great pass there by Zadorov. Backlund turns it to the top of the circle. Hannafin walks in. In the slot, Majapani again. Dell got a piece of that one to keep it out. Off the stick. Majapani working off the left boards. There's the one right here, Majapani with a quick shot. And Dell not sure where it is. Here's a turnover right in front. The backhand doesn't get through. Kajula with a shot. Save is made. Markstrom tested in tight. It took about six or seven years in his career to get his first shutout as Dell punches that one away and then it goes up high on the second stab at it. Back to the line and Zadorov has a look, but it his traffic in front. Sabres win the draw, Darlene off the boards, back to himself, he's right in front, Markstrom with the save, the rebound, Markstrom holds on to that one right on the doorstep. He's out and works hard every night, that's Darlene going to feed Hayden right there, he's looking to go far side, and Markstrom makes the first save, the second one, Johnny Hayden ends up putting it right into his glove. And it's off the boards to Kyle Pozo, and that will ensure the 5-0 final. There's the horn, another shutout for Mr. Markstrom. Yeah, fifth of the season here for Markstrom, but Sabres here, tough from the start.